Hey guys, so real quick, um, in the in the word of the Bible, it says, do not despise small beginnings, right? The, the Lord tells us not to despise small beginnings. So the Lord yesterday was giving me a lot of deposit. Like I was like, I need to write this stuff down. Um, he was reminding me of all the little stuff that becomes huge. And he reminded me how in the Bible, it says that as long as we have faith as small as a mustard seed. So man, with, with faith as small as a mustard seed, it says that we can tell a mountain to move and it will move. It doesn't require much, just tiny bit of faith. In James 3, chapter 3, verses 4 through 5, it talks about the small fire that can burn the whole forest. So a little spark of fire can become a huge fire. So you don't need something huge or big. As long as you smart off with something small and you're able to administer it, which reminds me of the master with the, with the talents. Remember, he gave different talents to, to his um, servants and they were, even though it was a little bit what he gave them, they were able to multiply it when they stewarded it and administered it correctly because the one who hid it was called the evil one, right? That was cast into the lake of fire. Um, Genesis, in Genesis... Todd White said this. He says, when we look at Genesis, the enemy was a snake. But when we look at the book of Revelations, he was a dragon. He was like, he smarted out small, but someone was feeding him. Um, another thing that God says, he says, if you are faithful with a little, I will give you much. When you are faithful with a little, I will give you much. So like the, the talents, he, he, he trusts us or he tests us with a little and then he multiplies. Okay. Um, again, when God created Adam and Eve in the beginning, he created two humans and he said, be fruitful and multiply. Now you look around the world and there are so many humans that were overpopulated, right? The Bible says that it's the small foxes that spoil the vine. The small foxes that spoil the vine. And also something else that it reminds me of is the widow that the prophet said, what do you have in your house? And she had the, um, she had the, the vases to fill with oil. And she collected some from neighbors, et cetera, et cetera. So with little, we can do so much. With very little, we can do so much. Little has potential for growth. As a matter of fact, when we're born, we're born as babies. And then we grow. We grow. We grow in wisdom. We grow in knowledge. We grow in everything, you know? So I just want to encourage you guys today that just because you start out small or just because you have something small, don't lose hope. You know, as long as you're faithful with a little it can become something great. So thanks for watching. God bless you guys and have a nice day.